Okay, in this video we want to find a z-score given a percentile, so what we're looking for is, for example, if we want to know the z-score that corresponds to the 15th percentile, or P15, um, what we're looking for is if there is a normal curve, the area under this curve is 15% or 0.15. Okay, so what we're looking for is this value right here. What, what z is that? All you have to do is use the inverse normal function, so you just do um, second vars, and then go down to number three for i and b norm, and you just put in 0.15. That's all you gotta do. So this value is negative one point, negative one point zero three six. Okay. Um, and it's pretty much the same thing for all the others. So if you wanted to do a twenty-five, uh, twenty-fifth percentile, you just do the same function, 0.25. And so this is going to be negative 0.674. And for 99, it's going to be the I and B norm 0.99. So it's going to be 2.326. Um, one good thing to check is if the percentile is less than 50%, it should be a negative z-score, and if it's more than 50%, it should be a positive z-score. So.